the Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Hello, Nelly. You seem excited about something. The Dedalian keys are back. The what keys? The Dedalian keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Rumour is that a former headmistress, Professor Moll, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, and they appear every few years. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? Each key will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may find a reward. Surely you will be trying to complete the challenge as well. Ah, oh, I've tried, and I can't even get past the first cabinets. Perhaps you'll have better luck. I'd love to know what's in the cabinets. Why would Professor Mole conjure flying keys? What I heard is that it had something to do with keeping peeves out of things. But that may or may not be true. He's a poltergeist. I thought they could go almost anywhere. Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope you do. In fact, I think I heard one of the keys in the astronomy tower. You should listen for them. I hope you follow a few keys at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find. If anything... Rebellion. To a flabbergasted leech, stirred clockwise. Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you... I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. Now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Focus. Defindo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. The art of potion making is delicate and, as such, requires great precision. Hmm. Very good. It seems you have a grasp. I would encourage you once again to practice here in the classroom, for your sake and that of everyone else. Professor Sharp, do you have a moment? Depends on how you intend to use it. I saw an aura badge on your desk and was wondering if you could tell me more about your time as an aura. Hmm. Observant. I suppose I could indulge you for a moment. Spent years tracking down reprobates who dealt in artifacts of dark magic origin. That sounds positively exhilarating. Exhilarating? Hmm. It was at that. While well, it lasted, at any rate. I enjoyed a great deal of success as an aura. However... Success can make one complacent if one's confidence is not tempered by humility. One overstep in battle changed everything. May I ask what happened? Yes, well, I suppose it's a matter of record. My partner and I had tracked a suspect to a harbour in Scarborough, 
trying to smuggle shrunken heads of all things. I had deduced that he was working alone. I was mistaken, and they knew we were coming. From the moment we stepped onto the ship, well, I barely escaped with my life. My partner wasn't so lucky. Uh, I, I suppose being an aura is dreadfully dangerous. I'm sorry. <sighs> it is that. But survival is not guaranteed for any of us. Pay attention. And not just within my class. This is what I must impress upon you all. A potion and a poison may be a mere breath apart until you consume the wrong one. Well said, Professor. It's a pleasure to have a student who actually heeds instruction. Expand the office. Defendo! As I mentioned earlier, Defendo can be versatile but dangerous. Good to see you continuing to practice. Hello, Hamora. Rebellion. Thank <laughs> you. 